you did some awesome clips with your action camera and with the DJI Action 4 like I use, but this fisheye effect bothers you, then this video is for you. I'm gonna show you how you can de-warp your footage in Premiere Pro with a free plugin. Let's get right into it. So, you have your footage in your timeline. Now you need to download a free, F a free plugin for Premiere Pro. It's called GoPro FX Reframe. Just go to Google and type in GoPro FX Reframe Premiere Pro Download. And download this straight away from the website from GoPro. Now you drag it on your clip. Here are a few settings what I recommend you use. First, you're gonna you want to make sure that you have here the check mark on source image as projection. Also, you want to have on the advanced controls the motion blur check mark unchecked, I think, because this slows down all your timeline. And also on source operations, you want you don't want to move the edge because that just look weird. So. Now you need only the, the lens curve control. If you drag this up and down, you see now that you can warp or de-warp the footage. I think around 50 here is the sweet spot. I think that looks pretty good, right? <laughs> so. As you can see, this slows down your, your timeline a lot. As you can see, this now looks pretty good. I just copied this effect and did this de-warp in After Effects like I did all the time before. And as you can see, I drag this on top of my timeline. That there is actually no difference. It looks pretty much the same I would say and that's good to me because I'm not so fit in After Effects. It's a little scary sometimes even though you can use it for lots of cool things like text tracking and stuff like this but I just prefer Premiere Pro. So with this plugin you can Dewarp your footage, make it look really cinematic in just a few clicks. Pretty awesome, right? If this was helpful for you, like this video and subscribe to my channel for, for don't miss out any future tutorials like this. Have a nice day.